Hello. Today we are looking at how to install SSF2 Crimson's Trash Mod Pack on a Chromebook. Please take note that you need a Chromebook with an Intel or AMD processor. Firstly, we will enable two settings on our Chromebook to increase the performance of the game. To do this we will go to these pages and enable the settings. The links are in the video description. Now we will reboot our Chromebook. Now we will turn on Linux apps. To do this we will go to our system settings and click on the advanced section on the left panel. Now we click on the developer section. Now we will turn on the Linux apps. Now that we have enabled Linux apps on our system, we will continue to the next step, which is to run several commands in a terminal, that will install the game. All the commands are in the video description. Now we will copy the first command and open a terminal session from our app menu. Next, we will paste the command into our terminal, either with a two-finger click on your terminal or click Ctrl, Shift, and V together. This command will enable 32-bit architecture on your system. Now we will update the system repositories of our Linux apps. Press Y and then enter. Press Y and then enter. Now we need to install Wine. Wine is an application that allows us to install some Windows applications in Linux. Press enter to confirm the installation. Press enter. Now Wine will create some files and folders which are required. Now we will install a package to extract the game. Firstly we will download the application. Now we will install the extractor with the following two commands.
Now we will create a folder to which we will extract the game. Now we will download the game. Now we extract the game. To launch the game we need to run the last command every time in a terminal. Let's do it now. Enjoy!